Good afternoon, every pony, and welcome to Can't Draw Horses Club. I've lost my mic input. Okay, I found it. No worries. It's just me today. My name's Corey. I'm always here. But since this is the first Can't Draw Horses Club of the new year, I may as well introduce uh, the thing. Can't Draw Horses Club is a time and a place to practice art. And today I'm going to be speed painting, which is basically you just try to uh, go as fast and as hard as you can so that you learn uh, efficiency and things like that. For myself, I really want to learn um, kind of how to... Uh, prioritize focal points and uh, values. So like how light or dark bits of the image are. Um, I've also prepared some tunes for you. I brought the bees. So let's uh, get over there and look at stuff. Uh, my first, my first image, I'm going to be putting the refs in a little overlay on top so that y'all can see it, but that's not, uh, I'm not working off the little tiny, the little tiny rock from Return to Oz, but, uh, here we go. Let's swap over to the bees and get a look at this. So, I've got a drum track on the left with just some really basic, like, kick and snare and clap uh and these are set to once they're finished either they play again or they just loop they go to another one in the in the list then there's this other one that's cello phrases and what this does is it instead of just playing a note it plays a cello phrase so like <laughs> let's here I'll, I'll 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 play one of these uh, 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 uh how how do how do that's 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 all everything. I didn't want to play everything, but you can hear that it's like boy 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 instead of Wah. so. Uh, third is the original voice lines from Ian from Desert Bus that we got the bees from. So I recorded just a chunk of silence, and that's set to. Just play again, 91% of the time, and 9% of the time it'll play one of these other lines, such as silence, which sounds a lot like science. Uh, special handling fees, not bees, and honeybees. So, look forward to those. I'm going to hit play. I find it mildly annoying to listen to, but we're going to go with it anyways. Yeah. All right. So, good audio levels here? Question mark? Special handling bees. Not bees. Not bees. All right. So, next up, I have Clip Studio Paint. Uh, and my, my stylus, I'm going to be using the Wacom... Special handling bees. Not bees. Wacom Intuos. My, my uh, doodle pad that I got... Uh, basically on a, uh, they were updating the art department at University of Lethbridge, and, uh, I got this cheap. Ah, no. Reference image. Oh god, what happened? Everything went away. Okay, never mind. Uh, one up my reference. It's not a five-finger discount. It was money. Oh, in other news, Ian bought me a bunch of little tiny Cokes. Look at how small this is. Ah, tastes like victory. Okay. Now, I'm going to use my phone as my timer. 
just swallow the whole thing. I'm not gonna put glass. I mean, microplastics are one thing, but uh, macroplastics? No, don't eat macroplastics. <sighs> All right, the timer. Uh, how long is good? Ten minutes? Ten minutes seems uh perfect to start with. I, I did some stretching of my arms and whatnot, but uh, I'm still a little tight. I, I twinged my neck on Friday, something like that. So I've been I've been careful, but my 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 left arm, my my special drawing arm, might get uh, sore. Science. So, starting timer. Boop. It's going, it's going. Oh God, I gotta draw a rock now. Oh, I'm trying the uh, watercolor brushes. I need these. How do I, can I just drop? Boop, it's green now. All right, perfect. Uh, rock, brush. How does this work? Yeah, yeah. Okay, that's kind of neat. Special handling piece, puppies! I'm s I feel like I'm going too slow already. If I used like a masking thing, I could do this faster. Beep 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 beep. Can I rough in where the stuff is? It's cute. Oh, I should pull up my ref on top. <laughs> Special handling piece, puppies! yellowy up this side and there's like a brighter yeah this is perfect yeah yeah going great uh, 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 I'm already already panicking this whole sides kind of dark Science! Watercolor is a bad idea. Yeah, it's mostly just layers darker over top. like the size of the brush. Special handling piece, puppies. Let's pretend these are leaves and stuff. Scribbly! Oh yeah, even color's not coming through. That's fine. Again, uh, I still need, like, values and etc. A darker patch up here. The brush isn't, like, sideways in the direction I expected it, because it's, like, broad and then narrow. But I expected that to be, like, to 90 degrees. 
because the, the brush shape is like that. Let's just go straight up black for Just scribble. Just scribble. This is fine. Science! I feel like I'm almost out of time. I have four minutes left. Oh my god. Okay. Just trying to relax. Science! Ah. I need these. I wonder if I can use like an eraser. Wow, white does nothing. Huh, interesting. I guess, uh, white isn't a color. Alright, here's the eraser. I want to try the kneaded eraser. That might be fun. Oh! This is a fancy new technology I've discovered. Pokies up top. Oh, where's my brush? There we go. Flat watercolor. More! Let me 
make this eraser bigger. Science! Yeah. Honey bees! Oh, that's it. Time. Okay. So, yeah, other than the watercolors not working the way I kind of expect. I've never used watercolors before in, like, real life. Uh... I think it was correct to, like, uh, fill with a bright color. But let's put this in a folder, and then I can keep them all separate and put them later. I need these. Name folder. Name. 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 Why can't I name thing? Maybe I don't need to. Let's pretend I don't need to and move on with our lives. All right, next one. What do I want? Uh. Uh. Okay, piano. So this is from. Doop -a -doop -a -doop -a -doop. A movie called The Night Before that's like a Seth Rogen stoner pick. Um, it's actually not bad. Okay. Let's try thick paint. Thick oil paint. Oh. for the timer. Ready, steady, go! Okay. So I think the gray that I've got is kind of correct, so we need like the magenta-y carpet. It's a guesstimate, okay? Rough in the piano. Wow, my brush is much smaller than I thought it was. There we go. Wow. Right? Yeah. I mean, it goes all the way to the edge of frame, so I should. There. Perfect. Definitely a piano. Black keys. Perfect. Well, let's get some booties. that. Then we 
something I like a happy dance. Scribbly. Definitely that color. This should be lower. Science. It was like a Dalmatian duffy sitting on the corner. Just like a piano. My entire perspective is way off, it's just like, <laughs> down. getting too warm. There we go. There's like some shadowy blobs. the wrong color shadow that's way too gray there we go
more on shadows and stuff up here. Closer color on the carpet. It's like a wine red. to do like smaller brush for smaller details at this point. Forty seconds left. Honey bees. Ha! Now I can name the folder. The first one was turn to Oz. This one Honey is. Bees. There we go. Alright, everybody, pencils down. Okay. So, yeah. Brush size is a big problem for getting smaller details, but just kind of blocking stuff out kind of worked. Although my, again, perspective is just like, Science. weep! Like, that's not the angle we're looking at. Well, Alright. One more of these before, uh, break. What shall I pick? Oh, yeah. Okay, we're picking a picture from a movie called Spencer. Take a look at this. Kristen Stewart as Princess Diana uh, hugging a toilet. Oh, let's make that uh, visible. There we go. Whoa, stretch! Shake it out! Not something you see every day unless you're me, Beowulf. No, I'm kidding. I don't watch Spencer every day. I wouldn't. It's too unpleasant. Science! Alright. Timer. Starkle! Okay, I'm gonna start with the back wall. 
Oh, that's the wrong color. Oh well. And then there's like a pukey green above it. Like, a, like an oak door. Science! And like a lighter brown floor. dress. hair and super I guess pale skin same picture it's the same picture block don't know what I nailed but it I did Science. yeah exactly like, like a silvery it's like a vertical pipe behind the toilet it's too small Detail lines on the door? Thank you. 
Special handling piece. Hot piece. So like, even though the gray lines aren't there, really, I think kind of sketching out the forms helps a lot. I've got two minutes left. I'm gonna leave the ref down uh, and just kind of try to fill in some of the space. I think 50 seconds is enough to get some, like, grid pattern going on the tiles. Apparently not. Not with this brush at this size. 0.8. Nothing's nothing's showing up. Science. Ta it's Princess Diana. We're finished!
Only Matt had you draw it. <laughs> had me to draw it. Monikers. I mean, there's still a chance in, like, telestrations or something. Right? Although, I don't know if, like, people would get the toilet connection. I think I'd have to draw her in, like, the little... Probably the yellow dress. I think the yellow one people would get. called Spencer. Wham. So I think uh, I'm gonna just sit and take a break for a little bit. And uh, then I'll take an actual break. Commercial break. And uh, then we'll do more. How's it going? said anything so I think chat died rip 2023 was going so well <laughs> hi fat <laughs> oh I didn't mean that the like the channel died I meant just that everyone who was watching spontaneously kind of like death note or the ring i guess and it's not even seven days although you do have seven days to find another person to show horse club to i guess because in seven days there will be another one also with just me oh busy painting sure angel excuses Oh, Mark Nine, you said the magic words, Dwarf Fortress. What's your What's your current fort Fort like? How's your fort doing? Hi. Oh, other people are building Dwarf Fortress. Well, gone too deep. I I started a fort. Okay, I'm gonna stop the music for a minute. So my brain works. So I started a fort and I was like, you know it'd be fun if I build in the caverns. Uh so I went down there and I was it was going really well because you can just grow things in the caverns. Uh and you know maybe there's like some giant invertebrates that are around and that's kind of the only problem and then i was digging and i uh released a monster because you can find them in the walls sometimes you can also find artifacts but you can find monsters in the wall it was an ember spider ghost that i couldn't hit and it was very fast and it had webs and it was chasing my dwarves and I locked it in a bedroom and the moment I did that a forgotten beast spawned that had dust so it was just like shooting dust clouds out and it was outside my fort which was currently locked down uh so it couldn't quite get in and then I was like a little bit greedy because I had like five dwarves left and I was like you know what okay it's at the very top of the caverns the very north end of the screen but on the south side i had almost blocked off a little cavern enclosure and i was like okay if i remove this stone grate that i have blocking 
my water intake, then some of my dwarves should be able to sneak out and quickly build two walls. Like, they only have to go, like, 20 tiles, but they should be able to do that before uh, the stink monster uh, gets there. And no, no, they died. They they died. I had to, I had to lock the door behind them. Um, and then it was just me and three really upset dwarfs and a spider locked in a bedroom. And then other forgotten beasts started spawning and they would just kind of fight each other out, out in the zone. Actually, I have a picture. I can bring the picture up. Let me, uh, whoop. On my desktop, what's this? Is this the one? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. So there was like a Forgotten Beast Fight Club. They were like dusting at each other and uh, making each other upset. So I, I did get bored eventually because my population was, you know, stagnant. Uh, I'd had children before the incident, but uh, they died. And uh, yeah, so now I'm doing other stuff. I've had some really weird bugs. I had one fort that like after one month, uh, they stopped digging or cutting down trees for two years. And it was fine because I could just like pick up plants off the ground and make milk and stuff. But that's not the city full of bodies. That was a different, that was a different fort. <laughs> None of these was the city full of bodies. <laughs> Which I, I was playing last night with Featherweight and I was like, you know what? I'll just reclaim this, this place. <laughs> Cause it, uh, so I, I, I made a good fort on a non-aquifer land and it was just like going really great and then i was like i need more animals so i should invade this goblins because the goblins have been spreading they've got like five things versus my like two successful ones and uh so i abandoned it during a siege <laughs> everyone died <laughs> and then i reclaimed it and I was like, oh, this is great, because it just clears everything out. Uh, even my even the animals. And uh the new the incoming dwarves, I would just get this notification that would just be like, stray puppy has, and then nothing. Which would be, I think, the death notification, but they it had lost connection to the, the items, I guess, with the bodies. Uh and I was like, well, I mean, this isn't this isn't the worst. Uh, but then that ghosts started po popping up and I was just like, oh my God, not again. I'm not going to just sit here for the next five years engraving slabs for these people. I, I just immediately abandoned it again. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Uh, Electric Claire, do I have any advice for surviving in an area where it constantly rains dwarf blood? Don't, don't let your dwarves get wet. They don't like it. Anyways, uh, let's take a break. And then we'll be back for more... Speed painting. That's what I'm doing. I'm painting on speed. With speed. Together, Speed and I. Best friends. Be back soon. Again. Did you miss me? Here on Cantroff Horses Club today, I, Coriander Dickinson, am speed painting. Ugh. Meh. Well, uh, regardless, I'm going to be hitting play on the tunes, incoming noises. The random Ian yelling is part of the music. I added the special for you. Let's pull. 
back my canvas and pick a new pick. Picture. Oh, this will be fun. Oh, that's not supposed to be over there. This is from Under the Silver Lake. Let me just pull that's that up. There they are. Alright. Reference. 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 How to marry a millionaire. Alright. Special handling piece. Hot piece. New dock. Layer. I'm gonna set a 10 minute timer. Ready? Steady? <laughs> Sorry, slightly distracted. Rook 9. Yes, yes, I'm aware of Roguelike Celebration, and yes, I did a podcast with Alexi. <laughs> Everyone should check out uh, Alexi Pepper's Rug-like Celebration Talks. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, bah. Bah. Ten minutes. Going. All right. Little brush. Little sketchy brush. Maybe a little bigger than that. That's big enough. It's a big wide frame. Is that too short? No, that's not too short. Yeah. Table. More, more horizontally. Then there's a TV. I need these. Over by the edge. Why am I slanty? That's weird. Doll head, doll body, doll big floofy dress. That doesn't intersect with the table. Is the table lower than I think, or is the doll taller than I think? Science! Stick legs, label. Apparently don't have enough room for the rest of my dolls. make uh, Marilyn skinnier. Just like that. Another layer and I guess multiply this one on top so that the lines come through and then get paint in the wall. It's kind of a red color. Yeah. Then it's like orange and yellow on the table. Were these labeled by the Zodiac Killer? Yes. Definitely. 100%. Nope. They were labeled by the person or and the person who wrote an algorithm or whatnot to crack the Zodiac Code. It was a consultant on the movie. Science!
yeah, Zodiac adjacent is definitely a way to describe it. I mean, please. Kind of a peachy tint to the thing on the TV. It's a little too too far, but it's gonna be fine for this. Science! Oh, bright pink. Sure. Yeah, let's go. Yep, this is human colored. Might as well do that with all the Barbie limbs, too. There's a lot of flesh on these Barbies. darker than that. You all can't see the colors I'm picking, so it's a surprise for you and me. are all pretty nice and white. What color are your Barbie skins? Oh. Oh. Science! 
Heavy static. I mean, I can take the snare off. Light microphone feedback. Hmm. Is it just on the voice recordings? Oh! My time went. Huh. It's a. Uh... I blame Twitch? Here's my girls. Um, they're they're all ready to marry a millionaire. Toe to tip. <laughs> Especially like, uh. Marilyn looks like she could be, uh, one of the cats from Cats. Yeah, middle Barbie. That's Marilyn Monroe. <laughs> Need some best of room tone to make this track pop. Yeah, I could pull some of that. <laughs> Alright, next picture. What do I want to do? Let's do something normal. This is a uh, Swedish nice. man. Finnish? God, what is this from? Is this from Hatching? I think. Okay. I'm gonna be so upset if it's not. I think it's from hatching. I can I can stop the music. Oop. Blessed silence. Love that. All right. Is he an artist? I don't think so. Because I can't remember what thing he's from. I blame OBS, honestly. Not not Ableton. Ableton's fine. It sounded fine on my end. It is somewhere in the the compression. Uh 
Okay. Ah. Oh. All right. Ten minute timer. You ready, gang? Let's go. We're doing it. All right. Uh, new thingy, 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 thingy stuff. All right. Uh. Get Mr. Arms in here. The face thing. Human face thing. Roundy head, ear, neck, arm stuff. Let's go put him over there. See, I can just make the music myself. It's just like this man looks. Yep, just like that. Just kind of a thingy. That's too steep. This thingy. There we go. Thingy. Thingy. And like a little dingle that you can't see. It's like a little lamp in the corner. And then he's in front of a door. like a ladder back there. Toe to tip. That's our man. Now, oh, what color is skin? That's not it. Closer.
He's got like a scruffy beard thing going on. <laughs> that's that's how, that's how to draw that. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> hmm. Lips. Doing some eye stuff. There we go. Blue eyes. Perfect. That's him. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Way off on that color. Green. <laughs> Yet another mistake. And there's like a thing poking out the wall. Uh, <laughs> just like that. Yep. Hmm. Okay, kind of a blue gray going on in the the plastic. That's too much. Ah. <laughs> uh, hmm. <laughs> I just keep looking back and forth. His his face. Oh.
Oh. Oh. <laughs> yep. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, time is up. Time. I should stop. <laughs> oh. But, like, I think, yeah, again, like, sketching some stuff out helped, but. Oh. Yeah, if you. If you, like, just randomly met me and just showed this to me on your phone, I would not be like, oh, I recognize that movie. That's hatching. Like, <laughs> I guess the same is true for the other pictures. Uh, what does he look like without the lines? Ah! His nose is gone. All right, kind of want to look at the things because, like, yeah, there's my rock, cheeky. Uh huh. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> like, I don't think I'm getting necessarily. <laughs> His mouth points the other way without the lines. <laughs> oh. Mm. Let's pick another picture. What is that? Blah, blah, blah. Characters turning around. Hmm. 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 Sure. Sure. All right. Uh, this picture is from a TV series uh, called The Dropout. There we go. It's got a lady on a phone. And it's like a dim foot in the background. So. Got my timer. Am I ready? Oh. Oh. Go! Yeah! Um, uh, small. Not too small. Move this over. Okay. So there's like a little desk thing. And we got a head. A nose and a hand. So there's like the corner of a chair. And then the stuff on the chair. I believe. And then there's like a section. Here's the foot. Perfect. That's definitely a foot. A shadow.
teeth. <clears throat> I'm the only one that can see my teeth crimes. Um, color. Don't even know where to start on the color. Uh, bed. Edge of chair. Skin, 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 shadow, shadow skin, no, up, better, mm. yeah, I guess better is all I can kind of hope for here. I no longer know what color anything is. What? Teeth. Yep. Yep. Cut a tip.
Ooh. Um, guess fingers. There's fingers there. I could give fingers. It's better. How do I make lips? What? Ah, timer. All right. There we go. Well, uh. <clears throat> yeah, I like the dropout. Um, it's kind of a bizarre thing to watch because the entire time you're sort of unsure about the main character and you want them to succeed, but at the same time, there's some truly awful stuff going on. It's not dark like um, the big sick. What's the one with um, Michael Keaton as like an old or dope sick? Dope sick. That's it. The oxy one. It's not sad and gross like that. It's weird. <laughs> It was blood testing she lied about? Yes. Oh. Um. Still feeling like taking... Is this a scream scene? This one? No, she's on the phone with her boyfriend while she's in college. The, um, the character's goal in life is to become a billionaire and just kind of do whatever it takes to get there. But it's not like pushing people off a building. It's just kind of like emotionally pushing people off of the building. All right, another folder. Oh, my lines. Ah. Okay. Time for more sits. I have done six arts, so now I sits. All that Dwarf Fortress talk has me wanting to play Dwarf Fortress. I keep being like, maybe I should stop playing Dwarf Fortress for a bit. I bought the Golden Idol yesterday. Um, the case of the Golden Idol? Whatever. So, like, 
in theory, I should play that and not just Dwarf Fortress, which I've been playing forever, so it's not like... It's not like I'm gonna, like, miss anything. It's not going anywhere. Oh, Peyton Little Robots, Iris of Ether. What's your project, Carrie? Little mini figs for friends? Or is this part of a secret project? Oh, Fallout Moon. Oh, Securitrons. They're great. They look like the um, scout droid from OG Star Wars. A little bit. Just the little leggies. Oh, wait. Securitrons are the ones on the rollers, aren't they? They're the ones that look like robots. I was thinking about Mr. Handy. Oh no, Eric the Orange. No, I didn't know magpies would do that. I'm trying to build a beach resort right now for my, my dwarves. I, I found an island that has no other civilizations on it. And I stuck them on the beach, so like... Three quarters of the map is just water, and there's no fish, and the trees are hot. They have the little warm sign on them, um, and uh, there's storks. So I'm going to try to catch some storks, and then I guess own some storks, because I'm not going to have any traders coming. That's the other thing that's going on. My civilization seems to... Not not have traders come. <laughs> I don't know what I did. I don't know. Oh. Yeah, maybe I should just end the stream early so I can play Dwarf Fortress. That's a good idea. We've had enough practice speed painting today so I don't have to go overboard I'm gonna look at this arts you got iris of ether I'll pull this over for everybody to look at blah, 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 blah. look at them oh and you got the faces for them right because there's like the one uh in New Vegas, right? You start off and there's a, a robot that comes and talks to you and has a little cowboy hat face. You magnetize the faces so you can swap them out? Ah, that's good. Good work. That's Horse Club approved right there. Victor, yes. Flyman. Okay. I had one fort where I was in the caverns and ant people kept attacking. But then I, like, uh, retired that fort briefly to go try to fix my capital. And then I came back and the ant men were no longer hostile to me. And they're just kind of hanging out in the caverns. Yes. Um, so I guess let's see. That's it, everybody. This show and many others like it are brought to you by you through support of our Patreon, patreon.com slash running ready run, and also on YouTube. Give us a thumbs up or say something. Say anything. Well, whatever it is. Some engagement. Do the stuff. You know what to do. I don't have to tell you. That's it.
All right. Thank you, everybody. Bye.